it's hard to cut, have a cutoff on whose health you're advocating for. So it's women across the board. And so women of all ages need to have this access to emergency contraception, especially the times when their physicians aren't available, weekends, holidays. And so this really ensures that. This is not to replace normal contraception. This is not to replace, like I said, your interaction or your relationship with your provider. But again, for emergencies, it's safe to use. It's great to have it available when there is contraception failure, when there is unprotected sex, or in the event of a rape. To eliminate the doctor from the conversation and to say that Plan B should be available for all women of all ages takes women and our, our children, especially our young girls, into dire risk. We're giving them authority as children to, to administer Plan B to themselves, which is ironic when they needed a parental permission to get aspirin in school for a headache. So we think that this is pretty illogical and every teenage mom should be concerned and mothers of, of girls of all ages should be concerned because this opens the door for a, abuse. That's something I don't think people are talking about. I mean, this is a pedophile's, predator's, pimp's dream. Unlimited access to abortion-inducing drugs with no oversight.